how's it going guys techno pippo here we're going ahead and let this cinematic play out and then we'll talk about what's happening in dark souls today Uh, basically, this is a uh, main boss battle. Um, I don't remember what this dude's name is. It's uh, there down the bottom, but in my editing screen, it's real small. So uh, I'll put it in the description. But basically, whenever you're fighting a boss, you always... Uh, actually, when you're fighting anybody, you keep a distance to see what their uh, play style is going to be. And uh, make a decision when you're going to go in and... Uh, hurt them and retreat not to get hurt but um, here we go if you've watched any of my other videos you can notice that uh, this is uh, early on in the game so I actually do not have my uh, ring on that when I roll I turn invisible it uh, helps you not to uh, get hit at different times and uh, depending on the enemy uh, you can kind of lose the enemy and escape when you have to but uh, yeah don't have that ring on right now now this axe that I'm using uh, I've actually got it near the beginning of the game and I've been using it throughout I have not switched yet uh, it does uh, regular damage and it does um, dark damage, so uh, it's uh, it does a lot. It hurts them pretty good. I I like using this axe. It's good with my play style. I like to uh, move. I like to uh, be quick versus having a lot of defense and just being heavy and not be able to roll too much. And I like a weapon that I can kind of swing quickly. And this is a good balance for my game style. See, I retreated to heal, and then there goes all my life right back again. <laughs> I almost got him. Come on, you can do it. I can't believe I missed that. That was terrible. Right about this time, I was thinking, choke, choke, choke. Got him. Lord of Cinder Fallen. Lord of Cinder. And there's my rewards. And a crapload of souls, hell yeah. Alright, laters guys. Y'all be good. <laughs>